Okay, um, one of the things that you'll uh, do to help maintain your computer is make sure that uh, your hard drive stays clean. One of the best ways to do this is to set yourself, set your Google Drive up. It's part of your school district 70 um, ID and it allows you to save all your files directly to that. But that isn't always easy for you to find or do. So we're gonna go ahead and install Google Drive on your computer, and then you can set it up as I have here where it appears right there uh, in Finder, and it's easy for you to find when you go to save files. So that is, again, a very simple process. It starts in self-service. We're gonna delete this. I installed Adobe previously, and I'm just gonna type Drive. Okay, I'm going to type it correctly and see if that works better. There it is. And that's where we're going to install Google Drive. So you'll go through that installation process, and then it'll be installed on your computer. But to make sure that it is visible, um, we might have to mess with our Finder settings. And this is a good thing to know about because if you lose something, you, you one of your Disappear, something disappears or you can't find a drive that's attached. Uh, a lot of times it's right here in your Finder settings. So you're going to go, uh, we want Finder, not Apple. Apple settings is uh, a bigger a bigger pool than we want. We just want specifically for the Finder. We'll click settings here. And you can look at general. You want to check all those unless you really don't want those things to, uh, to appear, but they will attach. Something else you might do, which I have done, is move this. You can choose what your Finder opens up into. I've chosen Google Drive because it means I look first for files in Google Drive. And that's where I'm trying to save them, to save hard drive space. So I recommend setting it up that way. Uh, it has to be set up, has to be installed for that to work. But configuring your sidebar okay, is it controls all the stuff that appears here. So whatever you check, okay, whatever you want. I don't mess with movies and music on my work laptop. I don't use iCloud. I don't really do CDs. I don't, I don't need any of this stuff. So stuff I don't know, I have unchecked. In fact, I can probably get that um, disconnected. So make sure all these things are checked and they will show up. Um, you'll be able to show up. Sometimes you'll find that all of a sudden you don't have your documents. Well. Come back in, check it. Sometimes it might not be displaying there. And uh, unchecking and rechecking is a way to restart that. So that will allow Google Drive, um, that will allow you good access to Google Drive through Finder. But you also will want to be able, once you've installed it, you will also have the ability to, um, to save files to it. So um, if I'm in a program and I want to um, let me go ahead and just make a new Google Doc save me and I'm going to export okay I'm going to go down here and save it to my to download rather okay I'm gonna download it as whatever it doesn't really matter okay um, it's gonna pop up in a second and it's going to give me this okay because I have installed Google Drive Google Drive is right there for me to choose and I can immediately put it where I want to on my Google Drive that'll be the case in all the programs running on Apple so it becomes very easy to use that drive as uh, as a hard drive just the way you would a hard drive once Google Drive is set up